What's up everybody, welcome back Rebel Chums. Uh, today we're going to take a look at the Saberfort Adamant, which is a new apprentice tier lightsaber. Uh, I already did an unboxing in terms of I unboxing it before you see the video. That's because I got a batch of nine of these lightsabers in one single box and five of them came quite heavily damaged to me so I have to send them back so I had to check the saber in advance uh, but here we go I've taken off the bevel wrap and here we go this is really 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 nice this is a really cool lightsaber it has been based off of the clan lightsabers from the prequel movies so you could see these lightsabers actually being carried by uh, the uh, characters in the movies and this is one of the most intriguing uh, apprentice hilt lightsaber that I've ever seen from Saberforts. It has greeblies, it has all kinds of stuff, it has a copper neck, it has a nice flat emitter, um, it's a very compact hilt, it's small, you almost would uh, uh, confuse it with a Shoto hilt. Let me grab a Shoto hilt for, for uh, uh, giggles. So you see a Shoto hilt next to it and you can see it's the same size as a Shoto hilt, but it's not dubbed as a Shoto hilt though. Um, but this is a really nice hilt. It feels really premium as well for some reason. It feels heavy. It feels solid, and um, I'm really, I'm really happy to have this one. To be honest, I, uh, I really think this is a good hilt. This one came in a, a mint condition to me, so I was lucky that this hilt was not damaged during shipping. Um, it also had no construction issues. Well, it has one minor construction issue. It actually, for some reason, these, um, this black piece here, it's hard to see. I will show you it in a full review. But there is actually um, some shim shimming, timing shims here. And those are sticking out a bit. And uh, because it's all glued together already by Saberforts, I cannot align that. And now that shiming, the, t uh, the, the timing shim is actually loose and it looks a bit ugly so I need to uh, fix that. Um, but it's an empty hill tier uh, lightsaber, it's called the Warrior tier by Saberforts. I'm gonna do a full review of the empty hill but also review it with electronics installed so you have a very good present rep representation of what this saber looks like with electronics in it. I think it's a very nice saber, I definitely recommend it. It feels nice in the hand um, I think this is one of the well better made uh, hilts from Saberforts. Um, definitely my top uh, uh, Saberforts lightsabers that I like so much, uh, including uh, with the uh, Saberforts um, Gladius. I really like it. It's a really good buy. Um, I recommend you guys looking into it and maybe picking it up. Um, check out the playlist on my left. Um, it contains all the Saberforts saber uh, reviews that I've done so far. And it's over 30 lightsabers from Saberforts reviewed on this YouTube channel. So I hope you're gonna check it out. And um, yeah, hopefully gonna see you back for the full review. And as always, stay scummy. Bye bye.